nice going, Mr. Parker. Boys, is Skip going to be proud of you when he gets back from Comfleet? <laughs> I wouldn't be too sure about that. Well, Willie finds out that we stopped off in New Caledonia. Whew. You did it for a worthy cause, sir. So that Virgil here could stop off and visit an old sick friend. Yeah, well, I saw that old sick friend. He didn't look old or sick to me. Uh, yeah, well, uh, like I said, Mr. Parker, it was a fast recovery, right, boys? Sure. Poor Bat Bat was saved by tender, loving care. Yeah, <laughs> Virgil's kisses are like penicillin. <laughs> Yeah, well, I still say I'm not tough enough on you guys. All right, now let's unload these crates and let's move. That's an order. Let's move. Uh, anything you say, sir. Uh, why don't you get that one? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I still say we could be in big trouble, boy. Skip lines up. Hello, everybody. Hello, oh, Miss Jimmy. Maybe you can help me with this end with it. Miss! Oh, no, she stowed away. Bet, what are you doing here? Oh, Virgil, I miss you. Uh, well, well, now, wait a minute. <laughs> Attention, at ease, uh, as you see, smooth. Boy, does she like penicillin? Oh, no, here comes the skipper. Boy, are we in trouble. Quick, get back in the box, and that's an order. My wife is now sharing. Boy, all right, you guys, uh, get busy. Act as though nothing's happened. Look nonchalant. Hi, boys. How's it going? Hi, Skip. <laughs> Chuck, how'd it go? Oh, fine, fine, Skip. Uh, everything's shape ship. Uh, I mean, sheep ship. Uh, sheep shot. <laughs> Did she give you any trouble? She, she, what she? The PT-73. Oh, oh, that she. Oh, no, no, everything's just fine, Skip. We really... <laughs> oh, uh, bad case of hiccups today. It's hereditary, like baldness. My mother had it. Uh, I mean, the hiccups. My sister was bald. I mean, my father. My father was bald. <laughs> that was me, Skip. I find Mr. Parker so amusing. Well, I'm not buying, boys. Come on, Chuck, what's in the crate? What makes you think anyone's in the crate? I mean, anything's in the crate. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, get up there. Huh? Not there, here. <laughs> <laughs> and those silly boys said you were so ferocious. Oh. <laughs> then you're not mad. We got a girl stowaway. <laughs> Me mad? <laughs> I'm gonna bust it. every one of you down to a apprentice seaman. You bunch of fouled up eight balls. Oh, wait a minute, Skip. Yeah, Skip. Let us explain. We had nothing to do with her stowing away. Tell him, Babette. He's right. It was my idea. But I thought it would be fun to be here with Virgil and the boys. Fun? Do you all realize what would happen if Captain Bampton just happened to walk by? Oh, we're still going to find out, Skip. Here he comes. Now? <laughs> Jumping torpedoes. Virgil. Get her out of here. Fast. But monsieur! Move and keep her quiet. Get out of here. The rest of you guys look alive. And if you know any prayers, say them. Now I lay me down to sleep. Oh, get up. So, sir, you really think that if the deal with that French plant of Bergerac goes through, it could mean a promotion for you? Of course. If the Navy can buy Molony Island from him, we can use it as an additional supply depot, oh. double our capacity. And uh, the whole thing was my idea. Oh, you are brilliant, sir. In fact, I would say you are one of the most brilliant, most intelligent, most outstanding officers that I have ever... Stop buttering me up. I'm on a low-fat diet. <laughs> Turn shut! <laughs> Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you, Commander. <laughs> Sir. Well, Parker. I am here on behalf of the United States Navy, Parker, to congratulate you on bringing the boat back in one piece. <laughs> My pleasure, <laughs> Sir. Hail. 
Yes, sir. Always good to see you, Mikhail. Huh? <laughs> How are things at Conflict, Mikhail? Any word on the Bergerac deal? Oh, yeah. not a thing, sir. Not a... Oh, he's a pretty hard man to deal with, that Bergerac. <laughs> oh! What is that noise below? How about a little Oh, 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 wait a minute, sir. It's a rat. A big, ugly one with beady eyes. <laughs> That's right, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> He's a giant, sir. We just can't seem to get rid of him. <laughs> Mr. Parker, go down there and give Virgil a hand. I'm a devil. You can count on me. <laughs> that man is a menace. <laughs> I'd sooner face a rat than a person like that. With you. This boat is a disgrace. Carpenter, make a note. Have this boat fumigated. <laughs> yes, sir. Better still, have it condemned. <laughs> Get out of here. Everyone, now, don't worry about the rats, sir. I'll take care of them personally. <laughs> you barnacle brain chowder heads. Do you realize what you've all done? Huh? If Binghamton ever sees this girl and finds out that you guys stopped off in New Caledonia without orders. <laughs> well, it was all my fault, Skip. I was in command. I'm going to turn in my bars. Any of you guys see my bars? <laughs> Monsieur Skip, why do you worry so? Nobody know Babette is here. I not even tell Papa. Papa? Oh, well, that's just Danny. Wait till he finds out. Oh, boy. Oh, you worry about everything. Let's have fun. Virgil promised me a ride on the pity boat. He said Babette can see. Oh, no, wait. I never promised, Skip. Quiet! And let go of that girl. Come here, young lady. Now, it's all because of you that we're all in big trouble. There will be no trouble. My papa is a very important man. All the big admirals know Charles Bergerac. I don't care if your father was Charles de Gaulle. If Binghamton ever see... B B Bergerac? Your father's the big plantation owner that's negotiating with Admiral Rogers? Oui, he's the one. So you see, we have nothing to worry about. <laughs> we got nothing to worry about. <laughs> Except whether we want to be shot or hung. Oh, boy, what a mess. Yeah, we'll never get out of this. Mom said I should have been a draft dodger. Oh, <laughs> quiet, will you? Let me think. You say your father doesn't know that you're missing? No, he's away at a meeting with the Admiral. So let's have fun. Let's go for a ride on the pity boat. Oh, you're going to go for a ride, all right, young lady. Right back to New Caledonia. <laughs> As soon as I figure out a way to get us there. Doggone it. Doggone it. I got it. I got it. We'll fake it so that the PT-73 has to uh, put in a dry dock for repairs. That's I it. will not go back to New Caledonia. Oh, no, wait a minute now, sweetie. We'll, we'll even let you steer the PT boat, right, Skip? Why, sure. We'll let you steer. And while we're out at sea, we'll even let you fire a couple of torpedoes. Oh. <laughs> Rachel, you keep your eye on Miss Bergerac here. The rest of you, come on, boys. We got work to do. Virgil, keep his eye on... What am I saying? <laughs> yeah, you keep your eye on a mamzelle. Virgil, I'll keep my eye on you. Come on, boys, come on. We've got to make a lot of noise and smoke. All right, now you heard the skip. He left me in charge, so I'm your commanding officer. Oh, now... you will have no trouble from me, Monsieur Commanding Officer. Yeah. Stow away Babette Bergerac reporting for action. For <laughs> action. Well... Uh, well, I suppose we ought to clean up the place a little bit. <laughs> we can uh, start with uh, uh, some of the... Uh, uh, yeah. 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 Um, uh, yeah. Ahoy, Carpenter, give us a hand, will you? Mikhail, what's wrong? Everything's wrong. We got to go to New Caledonia for immediate repairs. Where's Captain Binghamton? Well, you missed him by 10 minutes. He just left for your island. <laughs> All right, then. JK, forget everything. Get us out of here. Mr. <laughs> Commanding Officer, do not run away. I'm awaiting your order. Why don't you stop chasing me? Machine gun. Come on, Sherry, let's play a race. What's that? Sounds like machine gun fire, sir. It's coming from McHale's Island. Hey, sir. <laughs> 
put in the place all that shooting. It's all clear, sir. I hope. We've been hit. I'll get you for this, Miguel. Trying to kill your commanding officer. Well, I get through with you. You're all going to be hanging from a yard arm. Oh, no. You almost killed Captain Binghamton. Boy, we better hide. Oh, do not be afraid, monsieur. I will protect you. Yeah, well, when he sees me here, you're going to see a new kind of punishment. Hanging in front of a firing squad. <laughs> Captain. Put your hands up. All right, Miguel, so you didn't try and shoot me, but somebody on this island did. Now, which one of your cutthroat crew is missing? Oh, uh, no one, sir. All right, I will see about that. All right, you men, fall in. On the double. All right, fall right in here, man. Here we go. Fall right there. Oh, easy does it, Captain. Let's see if we're all here. Uh, 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 Gruber? Here, sir. He's here. Uh, 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 Edwards? Here, sir. Uh, Haynes? Yes, sir. Uh, who else? Christopher. Yes, sir. Uh, here, sir. Uh, here, sir. Uh, Mr. Bell. Bell. Yes, sir. Here. Here's Moss. Here's Moss. Here, sir. McHale. Uh -oh. McHale. Oh, McHale. Yes, yeah, I know you're here. What's the matter? Parker? Here, sir. Seems like you're all here. I guess I'll... Well... Parker, I'll give you the count of three to get out of that can. One, two... Uh, Miguel, Parker's out of uniform. <laughs> You're no ensign. Get over here, Miguel. What are you running here now, a foolish bizarre? Ah, uh, well, 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 uh, uh, well, no, I can explain, sir. It's all my fault. We'll have plenty of time to explain it. You're court martial. I really got you this time, Mikhail. Trying to murder your commanding officer, smuggling French girls onto an American naval base. All right, Mademoiselle, you will accompany me. Get her out of there. Uh, yeah, yes. Well, Gilles! Captain, you better be careful of the way you treat her because she's the daughter of Charles Bergerac. He's a very important man to the U.S. Navy. I don't care if he plays ping pong with Bull Halsey. I want to. Bergerac. Charles Armand Bergerac? Oui. He is the one. You heard to go and kidnap the daughter of Bergerac, you utter complete numbskull. Now, wait a minute, Captain. Nobody kidnapped anybody. That is right. I just stole away on their boat when they stopped at New Caledonia. Parker, you stopped off in New Caledonia? Oh, that really does it. You and your playboys are under arrest and confined to this island. Mikhail, you will accompany Miss Bergerac and myself back to Taratupa, where your assistance is going to be invaluable in making out the court martial papers. Yes, sir. You're all hearts, sir. Merci. Are you going to let this little... Squeak, 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 away from you. Show him your muscles. Ben, take it easy. Let's go, Mikhail. After you, Miss Bozrak. Oh! You're spirited, isn't you? Yes, yeah, yeah, sir. Yeah. Oh, are we in a spot? Yeah, this is the worst yet. Yeah, boy, are we in trouble. Dear Mom, this is your son, the ex-ensign. This may be the last letter to you for a while. I don't want to worry you, but I expect to be in solitary confinement. Hey, you guys, here he is. Hey, Mr. Parker. Stand up. Here, come on, get up. Get up. There he is. Uh, I'm glad we found yeah, him. What's going on? Let's get the chin piece on first. Oh, boy. Come on, now. Get, get it on. That's get the probe. Great. Sure. Fair chance. Not there. How does he look? Great. Terrific. Now, say something in French. Go on. We'll explain in a minute. Uh, Comment tellez-vous. Great. What does it mean? Well, you know the French. It means let's go out in the alley and pitch a little woo. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I get it. You guys are trying to smuggle me out of the Navy. Well, forget it. I'll stick around and take my punishment with the rest of you. No, no. If this idea works, nobody will be punished. Monsieur Bergerac. Uh... <laughs> hey, Captain, don't you think you're being carried away with this whole thing? Yes, I'm being carried away. As a matter of fact, I'm flying. This is the happiest day of my life. I am not going back to Papa. You cannot make me. I am staying here with my Virgil. Where is my little angel? Oh, my petit, my little daughter. Hi, 
going on here? Who are you? Who, 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 who? Is that an owl in here? I don't know. So oh, could they hit the old thumb? <laughs> oh, it is so good to see you, Papa. Papa? You, here's your Papa? This is Monsieur Bergerac? <laughs> Would they be kissing you like this if I was a stranger? You... <laughs> uh, how, how did you get here, sir? How did I get here? How dare you question the authority of Monsieur Charles Armand Bergerac? Take up. Oh. Well, I, I wouldn't antagonize him, sir. Monsieur Bergerac is known to have an explosive temper. <laughs> I, I, I apologize, sir. You see, I, I'm Captain Binghamton. I'm the commanding officer. Commanding officer. You call yourself a commanding officer. Stealing my child aboard the boat, planning to elope with this defenseless little girl. <laughs> No, 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 you don't, you've got it all wrong. I wasn't... For right. shame, an ugly old man like you <laughs> trying to trap a beautiful little girl like this in marriage. Marriage? Well, I'm already married. I would... Already married? You pig! You have brought dishonor to the French honor. I challenge you to the duel. <laughs> the duel? Uh, it's your decision, Captain, but I think you ought to know in advance. Monsieur Bergerac is the finest swordsman in France. En garde! Touché! Vive la France! Give it to him, Papa! Right. <laughs> Monsieur Bergerac, you are no gentleman, sir. Tell him, Carpenter. Oh, yes, sir. It is perfectly obvious that uh, Captain Binghamton is not trained to duel with swords. Uh, 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 thank you, Carpenter. You're welcome, sir. I suggest pistols at ten paces. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, please, please. Oh, I, 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 you've got this all wrong. I'm not responsible. But I, I have the men that, that did abduct your daughter. I have them, and I give you my word as an officer and as a gentleman. They will be punished at their court martial. If you'll step right this way, sir. I have the papers. These are the papers for the court martial. Papers? Yes. I have this for your papers. There will be no court martial. Nobody will know this. I will not have scandal or fraud to the name of the But, sir. But, sir, be you big of a cat. I take my daughter immediately and leave. Well, you have a right face. You have a boat that could take us to New Caledonia. Oh, yes, sir. Oh, but I can't do a thing without permission, sir. Well, I, uh, you think that he has a kind... Uh, now, 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 look here, Mr. Bergerac. Oh, God, you swing! Oh, go, 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 you've got permission. Uh, au revoir already. Au revoir. Come, quick, you said. We go on the boat. Oui, mon papa. Uh, but, sir, sir, just a minute, please. Uh, sir, uh, don't forget about the island deal. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, 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 Monsieur. I was hoping, sir. I was wondering, could we, could we close the deal for your island? You talk business at a family reunion? Oh, I tell it, Not a word is this to anybody. If I have to come back, I'm back. Can I come back? All right, all right. Here we, here we go, Monsieur. Monsieur. Uh, you make your papa so happy. Oh, come on, come on. There's no time for PTA meeting. Let's get out of here. <laughs> of all the foul, miserable luck. I tried to be of help, sir. I tried to be of help, sir. Pistols at ten paces. Oh, oh, don't you dare scream. <laughs> oh, you carpenter, right? Straight enough, here comes an admiral. It's Admiral Rogers. But Wipe those you. tears out of your eyes. <laughs> Captain Binghamton, we have good news. We've just closed a deal for our new supply base, and I'd like you to meet the man to whom we're all indebted, Monsieur Charles Armand Bergerac. Bergerac? How do you do, Monsieur? Guys, ah, guys, come in here. Arrest this man. All right, Fatso, what's your name? Binghamton, have you gone mad? Admiral, sir, you don't understand this man. The imposter doesn't even have a beard. This is an outrage. Hey, just a minute, lard belly. Ah, good work, Robert. Have you got him? Talk the real Bergerac was just here with his daughter. My baby, she was ill? Impossible! Don't you try name dropping with me. Come your smile! <laughs> Take your hands over that man! That is an order! Admiral, you don't understand. This man is not Bergerac. I know the real Bergerac. So do I, and this is the real Bergerac. He's just sold us the island of Melanie. Oh no, I did not. The deal is off. If this is the way your Navy conducts itself. Oh, so just one moment. Uh, come on, Admiral. If this is the real bit, then who was just with the. He had a. And he had it with the. Hey, with the. Oh, oh Mikhail has done it to me again. I. I, I will take care of Mikhail. Where is the 73? Oh, it's at the Knoxer. I saw it arrive just a few minutes ago. Yes, sir. I'll go with you. I'd like to meet the scoundrel who disgraces the name of Bezerak. Oh, Binghamton. 
This is the last stupid mistake you will ever make under my command. <laughs> you had to twist his arm and call him light belly. This is the last stupid mistake you will make under my command. Oh, you are wonderful, Papa. <laughs> hey, hey, that's my girl. All right, come on, you can battle it out in the boat. Let's get going. Oh, no, but you aren't going to drive us in boat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All of you men, stay where you are. Papa? That's your Papa? Oh, brother, we gotta do something. Chuck, Chuck, get on the boat and get out of that outfit. C come on, you go with him, bad bitch. Oh, oh, but Skip, she can't if I'm gonna change. I mean, you know. Move! Where are you come on? Let's go. All right, come on, you guys. Fall in. Fall in. Ah, Admiral, Admiral Rogers, I have. Uh, what a pleasure, sir, uh, Captain Bigerton. Oh, and Monsieur Bergerac, I presume. All right. <laughs> yeah, who is the phony Frenchman, and where is the girl? Oh, I want to hear it, and I want to hear it fast. I'm in command here, Bigerton. You shut up. Yes, sir. Uh, that time to shut up. <laughs> well, Admiral, to begin with, uh, we do have Monsieur Bergerac's daughter on our boat. Uh, she was a stowaway. Stowaway? My daughter? Never. You are lying. My babette is a quiet, shy little flower. Oh, well, if I may say so, sir, uh, the little flower is beginning to bloom. <laughs> you see for yourself. <laughs> Babette! Babette, come on up! Oh, no, Papa! She is my daughter. Babette, you come down from there this instant! No! Not until I get the pity boat ride, my virgin promise! You are defiant to your Papa. Your Papa order you to come down from that boat immediately. More. Me no! First I go for the ride! That's the phony Frenchman, it's Parker. Hey, Chuck, stop her! <laughs> Bring back that boat! Bring back that boat! You heard the captain! Hey, Chuck! You naughty girl, let go of that wheel! Oh, monsieur! You are not fair! You're having all this fun, let me steal! I was here first! <laughs> Let go of that wheel. As an officer of the United States Navy and your former papa, I order you. All right. We take turns. You steal, and I press the button. Right. Oh, no! No! Those buttons release the torpedoes! <laughs> oh, all right. It was a torpedo. <laughs> hey, 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 hit the deck. Here comes a torpedo! <laughs> Jack! Go reverse! Hard up point anything! <laughs> Gonna ram us! Stop him! Stop that boat! It's an order! <laughs> oh boy, now you've got it done. Wait till they get a hold of us. Hey! Hey! Get that dock out of the way! <laughs> And some Parker reporting for court martial. Lift this and run for the torpedo. Oh. Teach you to obey your papa. Now don't move from this spot. I have some apologizing to do to these gentlemen. I'm terribly sorry for what happened, sir. It is I who owe you the apology for the actions of my irresponsible daughter. If there is any way I can repay you. Uh, well, uh, there is that little matter of the island, sir. <laughs> I guess, of course. Needless to say, Admiral, the island is yours. Well, did you hear that, Admiral? We've got our new supply base. <laughs> I would imagine that'll mean a promotion for some lucky captain. <laughs> After what happened, Binghamton, I should imagine you'll be promoted down to Ensign. <laughs> now, if you come along with me, sir, I'll fly you and your daughter home in my personal plane. Bye-bye, sir. Hey, how about that? You and me, both ensigns. <laughs> this is the day I kill him. Captain <laughs> Captain <laughs>